A local synagogue in Midtown was vandalized over the holiday weekend, resulting in a pretty big mess. That's where we find News for Tucson's Angelique Lazardi with the latest on the investigation. Angelique. Well, Tucson police says that right now they are still looking for the suspect responsible for this mess here at the Temple Emmanuel. Religions and institutions aren't uh, anything that people should be lashing out at. Over the holiday weekend, Tucson police says Temple Emmanuel was vandalized, resulting in multiple broken windows and shattered glass. That anyone would would act violently toward a religious institution, you know, that's that's upsetting. Um, but beyond that, just a little confused. Tucson police tells News 4 Tucson they're currently reviewing surveillance video near the synagogue as detectives look into whether this vandalism is a possible hate crime. This behavior is totally unacceptable. It does not reflect who we are as Tucsonans. It does not reflect the spirit of Tucson and the ethics of Tucson. And Councilman Steve Kozacic says the person responsible for this mess needs to come forward. If these folks have any kind of sense of dignity and self-respect. They ought to step up to the plate, go back to the uh, Temple Emanuel folks, offer to pay for the uh, pay for the replacement of the, of the glass. And the Tucson Police Department also confirms that the JCC and the Islamic Center of Tucson also experienced their own incidents over the holiday weekend, but they are making it very clear that none of these incidents are connected. They also wanted to add that at the moment, there is no evidence that the crimes are bias motivated. We're live in Midtown. I'm Angelique Lazardi. News for Tucson.